Hello Airsoft friends, and Happy New Year to each and every one of you. It's 2021, we survived, and that's, that's a big deal, because I think 2020 was probably the most trying year for the majority of us out there, to be honest. It's been very different, there's been a lot of things we've had to get used to, and the fact that we are here now today is, uh, is yeah, it's no, no small achievement. So well done everyone, here's to hopefully a better year, 2021. Well, it can't get any worse, can it? Oh, well, I hope it doesn't anyway. I mean, it, it could do, I suppose. But anyway, we're here today to, to have a little look back, just to kind of like see where, where we've kind of gone through um, to get to where we are now. Not in terms of the world, more in, in terms of the channel. Um, and I'm going to give you a little bit of a sneaky peek as to what's, what's going to come in future as well, because I'm really proud of what we what we're building here our community is beautiful like genuinely like our community that we're building together is just absolutely it's great like there's room for there's room for conversation people can share their thoughts and opinions and like people actually have like you know dialogue about that and yeah like we're all here because we love the same thing so it makes sense that we just want to take part and progress that in a positive way so i want to say a very very big thank you to each and every one of you for, you know, being a part of this journey. Like, we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for you. So yeah, thank you very much, guys. I really, really appreciate it. You're awesome, stay awesome, and uh, yeah, I hope you'll stay along for the ride, and yeah, for all times, all times. So the channel itself has been an interesting ride so far. It wasn't until, what, like about a month and a half ago where I decided to start uploading daily Monday to Friday and that was the point where everything kind of changed in terms of like channel growth, views going up, subs going up and uh, yeah like I remember I was stuck on like 770 subs for a very very long time and I'd put videos up and and they'd get like a few views but nothing would really kind of move on from that and then I was like you know what daily airsoft content let's do that that sounds like a really good thing to do and you know what it was <laughs> yeah it was for me I'm enjoying doing it I love the fact that I'll just be like chilling and then I'll get an idea and I'll be like you know what I'm gonna make that and people are gonna enjoy it and if they don't enjoy it they'll tell me and then I can make a video that they will enjoy because you know it's a democracy and I, I, you know I want you to enjoy enjoy the content that you see so I, I'm gonna try and make fun fun exciting content and also want your input on what you would like to see as well because this is a two-way street it's not just I'm doing things and that's it you get to talk to me and I get to talk to you and I love talking to you guys in the comments as well I know you hear a lot of people say I reply to every comment in the YouTube but when I put the videos live I, I legit do I reply to every single comment that's on there um, there may be videos from like you know if I posted them a week ago or something like that there may be con comments on there which haven't been replied to just because the comments have been added quite a bit later on the video but pretty much every con comment that's been posted probably about you know at least three days after that video has gone live uh, I've, I've replied to and I try and keep that up because that's something which is important to me it's important in to build a community and to and to build up that rapport with you guys so yeah I will endeavor to reply to each and every comment in reasonable time after a video has been posted and also sometimes I'll just reply to really old ones just just because like there was a dude the other day who, who commented on a video that I put live months ago and uh, and it helped him out it, so that was good I like that I like helping people 2021 I am going to continue my daily uploads Monday to Friday like I said it's something I really enjoy and I like the fact that you guys are coming back video after video to watch it and enjoy it too so daily uploads Monday to Friday continuing. Besides daily uploads, my goal is to try and make uh, both YouTube and my Project Airsoft parts and accessories making jobbo um, essentially become self-sustaining. At the moment, I am hitting both things full time. This is everything that I'm doing, making content, uh, making parts, putting them all onto shop, all of that. It's what I'm doing full time. So my goal is to try and make that self-sustaining, which is, is quite difficult, like, to, to be honest with you. Um, it's, uh, I'm putting a lot of time and effort into trying to figure out the best ways to achieve that. And uh, hopefully we'll be, we'll be in a position where, you know, financially I am able to support, you know, myself from doing, you know, making the parts and also hopefully from somehow with, with, with YouTube too. You're probably aware that there's no adverts on my videos and I haven't turned any um, adverty bits on just because at this point in time, I'm not gonna be you know, earning anything from ad revenue. So there's no point in having it on there. But at some point in the future, when we do get enough views to hopefully 
bringing adequate ads, then that will turn on. But in the meantime, anyway, they're, they're, there's no point. So enjoy the ad-free content, even though most of you probably have ad blockers on anyway, because I do too. But yeah, anyway, that's that's a little insight for you into a, a plan or the plan going forward. Speaking of which, Project Airsoft is going to be getting uh, more time and attention. I know I've been kind of heavily focused on the YouTube side of things and I want to keep up that focus, um, but alongside trying to plan my time better between um, getting YouTube content done, relaxing, and then uh, and then doing Project Airsoft stuff as well. So there's new items going on to Project Airsoft today, which you'll be able to check out too. I'm also kicking off a happy new gear discount code, which is going to be live for the next two weeks. So if you go to Project Airsoft, the website, the link is just here, as it always is, and use the discount code new gear, you'll get 20% off everything. So yeah, hooray, happy new gear, everyone. So go check out the site. There's new items on there too. So I've, put, I've made a, uh, a wall mount for 40 mil grenades. I've made a wall mount for Glock magazines, a wall mount for Glocks themselves as well. So you can mount everything to your walls to make it nice and accessible. I've even got a M93 trigger holster that we're gonna be making trigger holsters for other pistols as well out there. Extended magazine inserts for Viper extended mag pouchy things. Essentially you put them in and it makes it much easier for you to insert and take out magazines and you can use them with like MP5s, you can use them with Vector magazines, um, you can use them with Mark 23, you can use them with pistol mags and yeah like essentially it just makes it much easier getting mags in, getting mags out and uh, yeah, like I've been testing them for a while myself. I've sent a load to some friends as well and some testers to, to test and they've all given them very positive reviews. So they're on there as well. So yeah, check those out. Even on the brand new items, there's the 20% discount it works on them. So yeah, enjoy, check it out. I am also in the process of getting patches sorted out. I've designed a load of them and I'm talking to different patch companies at the moment to try and find the best price for them because they're, they're a little bit expensive at the moment and I don't really want to do that but to get them cheaper I need to order a load and yeah I it's it's difficult you know like especially in the position I'm in at the minute trying to invest that amount of money into things um is quite quite tricky so yeah we'll see how that goes like I said I'm just trying to find a good manufacturer so if you know any good manufacturers let me know and we'll go from there a very cool thing that happened uh towards the end of last year um, was I started to do content on Novrich like rifles and stuff. You would have seen I picked up the SSG 96. I've been making videos on that. And um, I actually spoke to Joseph who put me in touch with their kind of like um, content creator management team. And when I bought my SSG 10, I spoke to them about it. They actually refunded me my order for that um, and sent it to me for free. So that's really cool. Thank you, Novrich guys. 2021, I'm hoping that we can expand our like relationship as to as to what we can what we can do to each with to each other what we can do with each other uh, in the airsoft scene one thing i will 100 percent say to you guys my opinions are all going to stay completely my own i'm not going to be somebody who gets something for free and then just says it's amazing like i'm going to get something i'm going to test it properly i'm going to give you my my honest thoughts and i'm also going to give them my honest feedback because i'm the kind of person who believes that you know, with my stuff, with my items, if something's trash or it doesn't work, I want somebody to tell me because then I can fix it. And that's exactly how I think a relationship like that should go. I'm going to tell them if I don't like something. I'm going to tell them if something's bad. And just like I'm going to tell them if something's good. And I like to think that's already kind of been seen, like that honest stuff in like the SSG 96, like the safety catch video. Although that was made before um, I, I like the SSG 10 and like us kind of like building this relationship together happened. But I, I feel like that's a good point to see if that's how I want to be going forward. You know, I'm going to be honest. And if there's an issue, I'm not going to gloss over it. And at the same time, if I don't feel there's something which those guys, you know, if, they, if I feel like they've done something wrong, I'm not going to try and blindly defend them. I'm going to be like, you know what, guys? You, you probably messed up there and then I can try and you know potentially help them fix it. We'll see but anyway I just want to say a very big thank you to to Novrich and the team um, and a very big shout out to uh, Mr. Dan as well who I've been chatting to there and also Joseph too for, for putting me in touch with their, those guys anyway. I'm really looking forward to seeing where we can build that relationship up to and where we can go and uh, yeah pre prepare, 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 prepare for me to be annoying because I will legit just call you out on stuff if I feel like it's necessary. But um, hopefully, I think that'll be something which will be positive for everyone. So yeah, 
good stuff. Another one of my goals is to try and build more relationships with more companies around the place. I'm actually happy to say I have a meeting next week with another company to talk about, um, about their stuff. So fingers crossed that goes well and, um, and we can carry on building up these, these relationships in the new year, which will all help to get the channel, like I said, to be self-sustaining, hopefully. We will see. And then maybe I can get some Raid Shadow Legends, you know, advert money, because that would be cool. Wouldn't it? Yeah, play Raid Shadow Legends, but not yet because it's not sponsored yet. The other new thing for 2021, which I'm kicking off, is Patreon. So, like I said, my whole goal and focus is to try and make both Project Airsoft and YouTube, Stay Fresh U Airsoft, um, all self-sustaining. And one way to do that is by crowdfunding and doing things like Patreon. So. I've started up a Patreon, link is in the description, you can see it there, and it is gonna be something I'm gonna be like talking about, you know, commonly across the channel, because it's something where it means I can give more to you, I can do more for you, I can give you more content, I can get you more involved with stuff, and at the same time, you guys can support the channel if you want to, you know, you don't have to, it's not like I'm holding a riff to your head and saying, do this now. If you want to do it, then you can, and I'll be ever so grateful uh, in that. And the thing is, it's gonna allow me to continue to produce content because if I am unable to, you know, make Project Airsoft and the YouTube stuff self-sustaining, then at some point in time, I will probably need to get a job and that's going to impact my, my content -y, content -iness. So yeah, this is why I'm working really, really hard to try and make sure I can get everything self-sustaining uh, monetarily within, within both Airsoft and Project Airsoft. And uh, yeah, fingers crossed we can do that because yeah, I want to carry on making content for you guys. You love it, I love it, so let's just keep doing that. And hopefully Patreon will be something which um, will will enable that too. So yeah, Patreon is now a thing. Check out the tiers. Give me feedback on the tiers as well. It's the first time I've ever done something like this, so your feedback will be you know, very much helpful in that. If you feel like there's not enough value in some tiers, or if you feel like there's too much, or I can like wiggle them around, then please do let me know. If you've got ideas for other rewards I can put on there, then, you know, please do let me know because this is something, like I said, I want us to, you know, to work on things together. Like we are a community, we're a very positive community, and I feel like we're all working together to make Airsoft a much better place for everyone out there. And I think that's a, a very, a very solid, goal for 2021 as well you know improve improve how you know the the the, the airsoft community as it were um create content and create opportunities for us to work together and just uh you know make make airsoft a much more positive place to to be so yeah there we go that's my spiel happy new year everyone i hope you have a fantastic 2021 i hope that 2020 wasn't that bad for you or or too bad for you I know it's been a, a pretty naff one, but it's over now. And uh, I'd like to think that the worst has passed us. And fingers crossed, everything will just get better now. So 2021, let's smash the shit out of it. Let's have a great, great year. Can't wait to get back in the field again. And uh, yeah, as always, guys, remember to call your hits. And I'll see you in the next one.